Well, this Friday morning, we have breaking news from Norfolk. Right now, four gunshot victims are at Centera Norfolk General Hospital. Police say the victims showed up on their own, and we have just learned the victims were shot on East Brambleton Avenue near Norfolk State University. That is where we find 10 on your side's Camaria Bray now, who has been following this story all morning. Camaria? Yeah, we just learned that this shooting happened here at side of the 7-Eleven or around the 7-Eleven, which is right across the street from Norfolk State University. We talked to a viewer who witnessed that shooting early this morning, and I do want to show you, um, we're going to try to zoom in, that there is a big bullet hole right in the window of this 7-Eleven. The person that I talked to, the viewer, says that she was right on the other side of where that bullet hole is and that's where she um, heard someone say ow that they had got shot and again those people are now at the hospital they were taken to the hospital around 2 30 they were all um, transported on their own they came at different times that's three me three men and one woman three are in serious condition one is in good condition now when we were at the hospital police had taped off the outside of the um, hospital the emergency entrance there was a car that, that was surrounded by that police tape that may have been one of the cars that brought one or more of those shooting victims. Now, again, that viewer who witnessed the shooting said that there were 15 to 20 cars in the 7-Eleven parking lot full of NSU students. That person said they had to duck and take cover at, inside the store when they heard the sounds of multiple gunshots. For their safety, we are not identifying them, but listen to what they told me. So I to walk back out the door, all I'd seen was like fireworks from shooting, uh, shootings back and forth, back and forth. It was a guy on the game machine that was playing the game, and I heard him say, oh. And here at the gas station, we haven't seen any Norfolk um, Police Department uh, po police officers, but we have seen a Norfolk State police officer that is here again. Three men and one woman were shot here earlier this morning. We're still working to learn what led up to that shooting. Live in Norfolk, I'm Kamaria Brayton on your side.